Zaikin, I guess. Yeah. I like the look of that dive. He backed off me while on the top lane. Zai committing and will find Kezi. That's the first blood yep. on him, but not going to be happening this time. TZ hugging the tower, playing defensively, does get charged, but Zai's already ready to cut this off. Gets the two hero burrow, kills off Puppy, punishes him. The warding has been impeccable. I mean, yep. You mentioned the one ward bottom. They might be able to get Sumail here, though. This could be huge. He's a bit isolated from his team. The lone cow could be punished. Charging from Puppy gets the bash. Needs a little bit more. Kanka coming in with the Torrent as well. Trying to lock him down. They need that Shaker. He walks back in. He gets up the Echo. He gets up the Totem. He's going to kill mid one. Oh, not good. Not good for Secret. Stays alive. Sumail. The cojones on this one. Or soon after. They want to have a kill. Yeah. Like you they want to get something done. You don't pick Clinks and Weaver as your cores and Spirit Breaker Kanka with back. a Darkseer to not have kills. But... Fine, there you go. One. Look at the three hits, chunking crit down. The charge is going to get cancelled. I think that was a miscommunication uh, from C Secret. Puppy was charging, and now the Blink Dagger reveal. Echo comes in, but that Clink's pretty tanky. Not the easiest takedown and will be alive. Yaps are there to break the lasso. Nicely played, and now trying to run away. The charge through. Puppy pile drives crit back. Just leave my pesky Woo! Bone Fletcher away, he says. But, no, oh, Spirit Breaker going to go down here. As Sumail comes in for round two, Fisher's there, it traps in mid one, almost but not completely. I'm gonna set up a gank here for on Kezu up top. No shapeshift this time. Sumail does not have Echo yet. He's gonna try to start with an Enchant Totem. Fisher comes through, hits the Darkseer. That's not the target he wants. Now the Enchant Totem back on the Spirit Breaker, but I think the jig is up, and Sumail wants to get the hell out of dodge. Still, though, tanking some Searing Arrows, dropping low. He's still extremely, burrow. extremely durable, but pulled back into the vacuum. The boat, the pain for EG. One Searing Arrow, almost half his health down. MP wants to chase. He's committing for this. It's going to take a couple volleys of auto attacks to get the job done. He time lapses out. Not quite in time. Meanwhile, and now MP in danger. He's on the run. Yeah, the Spirit Breaker charged through an entirety of EG, so he just died, and now they're going to try to cut down EG. What a visual block! Traps MP in. Sakuchi's down. No time lapse, and he's going to get burned down. Vacuum bolt. Torn! Huge Echo Slam to take down the Weaver. The bolt's going to come in. They will take down RTZ as a trade. The universe does have Black Hole along with the Blink. Secret got to be careful not to group up. Yep, so sitting back <laughs> once and it is just in time. He is able to do so now. Jumping forward, Puppy commits onto Sumail. Sumail is in trouble being overrun. EG's position has been completely compromised. They go for the Roche now, but Lycan has a wolf in it. RTZ on point here with his micro. This is why in bygone days, teams always bought a gem. And EG immediately smoke up. Lycan. Puppy breaks a smoke though, here we go. Zai's in first, he gets the burrow, it's only on one, and not really the easiest target to take down, with Kezu having the mech, having the pipe, and the arrows come blazing in, taking out Zai quickly. RTZ tries to man fight, but that's not gonna happen until Universe is there. The X was already committed. Vacuum though is there to cancel the black hole, and now Secret are on the warpath. They're gonna turn for crit, they look to bring him down. Big commitment from Sunel, the totem will end MP. Still though, mid one stays alive. A three for two, and it's with all the ults expended. They might lose Sumail. Oh. Two more auto techs. Epsor, he's, he's not again. giving up the ghost yet. On oh, the wait. chase, he didn't quite get it off. Epsor has been missing a lot of his x bolts combo, and now... But he has a BKB though, they've got it completely changed on him, the vacuum interrupts and now mid one can turn if he needs to, Zai's low, the swarm hits him, and now Universe comes in, decent to hero, black hole, Yapsor doesn't have a whole lot to deal with this, but the Clinks is just dishing out damage into it, still though the team's getting overrun, still is not BKB, mid one's now lassoed and controlled, BKB finally comes out, but it only marks his tomb, now Yapsor on the run, oh secret, not oh. respecting the EG combo, they're gonna lose a fourth, Oh, well, that will impair your vision. How about you do it first, and then as it's going, then you, you put the shades on. They're going to try to start the fight on Puppy here. Fisher comes in from Sumail. The Yule Scepter to interrupt this chain of initiation. Now the Enchant Totem comes through, but they get scared and they back away as the Black Hole's committed, but it's on a BKB Clinks. He's not taking too much damage. They can look to turn this. Chunking down Universe. Mid one gets his vengeance. Now turning on the Batrider as well. He pressed his BKB and Secret will deny EG here. Zai comes in late and he'll likely be the third down if Yepsor can get him, but he doesn't have the mana. It's Puppy charging through, connects on two. Also finding Sumail in addition to Zai. They'd love to grab additional kills, but even more than that, a right long on. way to go for the smoke gank. Zai just wants to farm a wave. And he will blink out in time, but still Puppy gets enraged for the nether stick. <laughs> the burrow gets him out to safety, Zai.
have to be careful about this initiation. They don't have a gem currently. And now in comes the Fissure to start the fight. Follow up onto the Darkseer. The Echo, hey. they commit. They hole as well. And running into it is the Spirit Breaker who can interrupt it. Universe gets off a butte and the black hole overwhelms. Now four have fallen a complete route of secret as EG make their move through the river, Ooh. lurking on the high ground. Arcane Rift. Our secret, and they were scouted by a Radiant Scan, but Yapsor is going to jump in first, tries to bait something out. A little extra shenanigans oh. for him. Now Sumail confidently lumbering up with the oh. Shiva's Echo initiation. He gets the party started. Zai's there to follow up. Look for the hole. He's got to fight. Oh. That's three. Universe, you monster. How could you? Puppy and all his monitors are in shambles. Secret on the run. Completely overwhelmed. Uh, rotation have been spotted out and countered. We were talking about how EGL was playing very well with rotation. They're going to go right into crit. Crit has a self yules. Black Hole is ready again, though. The combo's available. They got to be careful about this. Puppy wants to back away, but the boat comes crashing in. What will it accomplish? Really nothing. It's a bit of a fail boat as EG just popped their BKBs and rained down Shh. pain. Applause for Zai, patting himself on the back. And EG hot on the chase. Secret give up. They throw in the towel. Another loss for them and a crucial one here. If they lose this game too, they are guaranteed to be no better than 8-8 eight and eight, and they have to then 2-0 Liquid as well as Fnatic. You always want to have like magic damage to punish those defensive decrepifies. Applying the right click, Ricky perhaps will cut him off? Oh, he wants to. He's waiting behind oh that Oh my tower. god, Man. Zai? He also knows. Oh, Zai actually gets the first blood. I think the whole lane swapping will cost a little bit of time. Um, I think it's just better to just rotate and help PL oh, on, on the bottom. A big dive here as Universe has all kinds of napalm roasted by Kez. He will be finished off. By the way, in the mid lane, mid one is... Oh, hold that thought as they're diving Arteezy. Looking for the pick off here. They're going to lift him back. And, get and they kill. will kill yeah. him. Oh god, every game was like anti-mage versus Spectre. <laughs> whoever, whoever got that one of those two carries usually won. Yeah, at least okay. in the early games. So male. Gonna get brought down again. Mid one all over the place right now. He has the urn. We'll pop it on Zion. Look at how fast he goes. That tornado hits no one. Off lane Batrider, but the bottle was very important and allowed him to pick up more kill. Mid lane EMP tornado flying off. Zai is gonna eat it all out of mana. He's gonna go down. He pops a magic wand, but on the back line, delivery here from Kezu grabbing Sumail. Sumail trying to turn around. Nice ultimate here from Universe. Gets it stolen here. Yapsor's got a chrono. Is he gonna chrono help his buddy out? No. Looks like he's going to go down regardless. Mail Kezu trying to run out. The fire not doing enough on the back line. Kezu, make it home, my friend. He has two bottle charges. They still have Chrono. He will use it. Void just walks through it. My flavor, my immersion, not going to work here. Universe jumps back. Quick, this hero moves when you have face boots and Wex. It's moving over 440 MS. I mean, the old build was literally race car, where you'd also yeah, yeah. have drums as well as Yules. Nice yep. pick off in the bottom lane by Crip. But mid one is making a play on Arteezy here up top. Is the MP gets dropped, Arteezy tries to leap away into the trees. It the will MP, connect though. with the tornado crashing through. Arteezy might be done for. He hits the tower once. Not ideal. No Arteezy way. low, but committing for this and bat failing out his buddy is MP. They'll get the kill. Zai on the chase. Stomp's only going to hit MP. Probably not a possible kill. In fact, meanwhile, Universe is being hounded. Do they want to commit for this? They do. Lasso coming in. Tricks of the trade deployed. Mid one's there. Pumping in the damage. The flame oh. He manages to walk it up, but still the cold snaps keep on coming. The urn is there. Big commitment. Lance will end that void and set him back a notch as they do get the bat out of the end of streak. They also clean up Puppy. Universe coming in from the side. Kezu has the... Oh, didn't get the lasso off, but now could be in trouble. The veil comes out. The tornado's off the mark. The life drain. Ooh. Almost finishing him. Universe commits the chrono. He actually gets three with it. It looked like it would only be one. Oh. And barely. And now the pain as the earth splitter really punishes them. They do steal the chrono, but there's not a whole enough damage to pump into it. And actually, MP was caught within. He'll drop. However, EG are... Going for triple BKB now, it looks like. Oh, okay. hold that thought as the Shaman is going to get jumped. Lifted, pulled back. No Glimmer Cape to save you this time. Crit dies in a hail of spears. But yeah, you've got a BKB under construction. Actually, more team fight action breaking out as the lasso comes through. Dragging in Sumail, pulling him deep behind enemy lines. He will die in the flames, burning to bits. And now MP gets in, but he's taking too much damage here. He has Tornado. to back away. He's blown up by the punching action of Zai. Zai will die in turn. Still a three for one. Rubik right now with the stolen leap. Can be a nice way to set up for another spell steal. Give your team that extra bit of attack speed. Yep. Push on in. We'll see if Yapsar wants to lend that assist. 
They're pushing multiple lanes at once. Invoker with Alacrity going in mid. Top lane looks like the Shackle has happened, but MP very tanky with a heart. Chronosphere being spent on the mid lane. They want to get him dead. Oh no! Ricky walks into the Chrono. Earthspur is going to use mid one. Going to go down. Puppy's going to get caught as well. He'll pop his ultimate on the back line. MP jumps in, assassinates the crit, and he goes down. And with the, some of the big ults expended, still no sign of a buyback from Arteezy, and now he's done it. He's stolen the Nether Blast. Towers are going to start melting. Yep, Sor, he's the siege engine. He's the team fight. He's the carry now. MP is just the beef in the front lines. Structures are the name of the game, and Secret are making short work of them with this particular grab. EG on the ropes, soon to lose their first melee. They've got to find a way to answer back. Good doppelganger back. Yapsor continues to chip. How much do they want to commit? He's still got Aegis. Time's running low. Arteezy jumps in. They really want to crack that Aegis once without committing too much. And then on round two, come back and really throw everything they have at him. But Yapsor, he gets back to safety. He's stolen the time walk. Universe is diving deep for this commitment. <laughs> but Yapsor is already zipping away to freedom. Everyone on EG scrambling after this pesky Grand Magus. But he keeps on He's got running. Blink. He's got Blink. The escape running it just keeps on giving eg cannot cage the yap god yo they're coming back in right now the universe is trying to jump away he does have to last last on the back line they find one and they're gonna try to bring him down here comes yapsor again he's gonna go right in lots of damage output they take down two immediately arteezy also in trouble i believe he has leap he will use a tornado coming in from downtown arteezy gets purged arteezy losing out of the mana arteezy goes down oh. zai's on the run he's got the glimmer cape you don't have any detection oh they stole the wards crit wanted to go for the shackle he didn't have the range on it and now the base is really in trouble if yap can just blink in pop those Towards that with the PL. Oh, you bet he will. Secret is going to take a lane, maybe two. Mid is low enough that perhaps he wants to save it for top. MP though able the to The arrow, the arrow caught mid one in the back line. Are they going to capitalize on that? They need a lot more. The Chrono comes through, but instantly stolen, lifted, and interrupted. Still, the Earth Splitter connects all the same. So they'll have to save that Chrono. Well, let's get back in the game. What can EG do now? It seems like they'll be charging bottom. They're, maybe they just want to take a Hail Mary fight to Puppy get a Rex. there, though, to reveal this. However, he does get caught out. Hexed initially. The BKB lasso coming through. Good connection. Do they have the follow-up damage? Pumping it in from the side. Mid one tries to get the job done. Still the Rubik, though, with the stolen Chrono. Trying to get in position to set things up. He drops Chrono. it, and Crit walks into it. It's a triple catch by Yo! But they don't have the follow-up quite. It looks like they're lacking detection during this time. Can they get the kills? They right... Rush forward onto crit. Looks like Pale should be able to finish him up. Hexed up won't matter. Zai now surrounded and being dealt with by two. Yap stays alive with the Yules. The blink out still keeps on giving. The spirit comes back. Oh, he goes for the oh. And finally, Zai finally kills that goddamn Magus. But the Yules is there. TP interrupted. Tornado and revenge for secret. Four. Four down. No buyback on our TZ. By the time they get in position, it's already too late. They still want to fight this. Claimed. They want to take the engagement, but the Peel Illusion search forward, and they get onto the Shadow Shaman. Glimmer Cape retreat, but the chase is on, and mid one's there. Starts it off with the Yule Scepter, holding him himself in position for now. Crit drops down and is in trouble as the Peel locks on him. Meanwhile, the Bat Rider onto the back lines. He gets off the BKB lasso, trying to control that, Earth, that Elder Titan, but a really good Chrono from Universe comes through. What can Yapsor do? He's stolen it. He bubbles up the Pugna, keeps him in place for now, and Secret have the extra lives. They've got the firepower running through the void, pummeling Arteezy as well. Streak after streak being claimed here. Secret rampaging through EG. G -G. A must-win game, and they do pull it off. Wow. They need to go 4-0. To avoid an 8-8 eight eight fate, they still have a shot.